he was out here earlier. What are we looking for? My little friend Gilbert. What does he look there like? There he is. He's right there. No I way. Do you see him? Oh, 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 he's going Whoa. this way. currently in North Tucson, Arizona. We happen to be staying in a really cool Airbnb. Mario, what do you think of this place? Oh, I love it. It's nice, right? It's yeah. got a good view. It's high up in the uh, saguaro hillsides of Tucson, which it is famous for. Look at that. Oh, there it is. I see it. This is us, guys. Say hi to Mario. How you doing? Y'all set? I'm all set. Okay, let's go. Let's check out our digs. All right, let's see if anyone's home. Ready? Yeah. What's going on, Coyote? Hey. That doorbell keeps going. What's going on, Coyote Pack? Welcome to Coyote's Crib On Location Edition, where we're gonna explore a crib that Coyote doesn't actually own. We're just staying here because we're on location in Arizona. So if you're ready, follow me. <laughs> where are you from that? Well, we've got the option. We can go right or we can go left. Hmm. Which way do you want to go? Left. Okay, let's go this way. <laughs> that's our right. Oh, that's my left. <laughs> all right, first things first, the kitchen. Check this out. Pretty spacious, right? Looks nice. What all, all right. we got? Why don't we uh, go rifle through some stuff? Well, yeah, everybody always wants to know what's inside of the fridge. What's in the fridge? Let's look inside of the fridge. There Ooh, it is. Nice and cool. Oh. Yeah. Popsicles, the most important thing you can have in your entire diet when you're on location in the desert is Freezy Pops. Mm. I love those. Don't eat all the red ones. You know I like those. Yeah, I know. Don't want to melt them either. Okay, so what is it that we actually eat when we're on location? Is it really, really healthy? Oh, uh, kind of. There's sort some of. vegetables in here. We've got yogurts, right? Yeah, we got some. Uh, ooh, those are mine. Don't touch those. Yeah, I'm not going to eat those. Uh, what else we got? Ooh, the LaCroix. Who got the donuts? These are Mario's. Mario. Got the donuts. Yeah, yeah, Mario donuts. likes chocolate donuts. Can't have too many donuts. We have got juice. Mm. We've got Kool Aid. Those are mine. Uh, LaCroix, shared by everyone. Ooh, here's the healthy stuff. Check out that uh, little baby right there. Yep. Mm -hmm. Look at those blackberries. There's something right there. Mm. Okay. Come here, come here. There we go. Yeah. Mario? There mm. you go, buddy. Thanks. Mm. Wow. Oh, yeah. Vegetables are great. Do you know what's better than vegetables? Snacks. Mm. This is snack central right here. More donuts, cookies, fruit snacks. There is something healthy. Bananas are technically healthy. Is that oh, your gum? Yeah, these are my gum. These are awesome. These are ice cubes. We are not sponsored by icebreakers, but we should be. Look at this dining room. All right. Woohoo! Check this out. Seats four. Look yeah. at that thing. What is that? I don't know. What is that? I don't know. It's art. That's what they call it. Okay, let's go this way. Woo! Come on, Mario. Now this is the family room. How enormous is this? Everything is huge. The ceilings are uh, higher than I can uh, touch. Mario, jump over that thing. You can actually lay all the way out and take a nap. Hey, you guys want to see something super cool? Super cool? There's a tree in this house. I'm completely camouflaged. Oh, it's a fake tree. I thought it was a real tree, but it's still a tree in the house. Gemstone. Gem it's crazy. That's the garage. It's really dark. Let's not go in there. It's scary. I'm not going in there. So that's that side of the house. If you go this way, this is where we actually sleep. Right here, we've got a pretty cool bathroom. That's a huge tub right there. Standing in our shower, man. Hey. Little privacy for when you're actually taking the shower or using the lavatory. All right, this is one of my favorite rooms right here. This is the guest room that nobody actually stays in. It's got a blow-up mattress, and look at that eagle. It's a giant wooden eagle. It is wood. Yeah, it's pretty awesome, huh? Okay. 
Respect the bird, guys. And here you've got an ancient computer, just in case you need to contact the space shuttle or anything like that. Yeah, I think Neil Armstrong's on the other line of this. Yeah, it's a lot of high-tech devices look, right look there. Look at that, folks. Yeah, that's old school right there. Oh, that's got a CD-ROM drive. Does it? And oh, a floppy man. drive. This is crazy! <laughs> Mario's room! Check it out! This is where Mario sleeps. Look at these flowers. What? Mario, can you explain these roses? You bring some weird stuff on Oh, I gotta hit the day. light. Can't see. I got no lights in Oh, here. no lights? No lights. This is pretty nice. You've got your own little walkout patio there. Come on down the hall, guys. What's in here? Linens! Towels. Linens! And towels! Toilet paper. Oh. Lots of toilet paper! Oh, put rabbit on it. Yeah. All right, are you ready? I wonder who got the biggest room in the house. I got the biggest room for sure. <laughs> Ready, one, two, three, here we go. Hey, ho, it's Coyote's room. Look at this mansion is spread. <laughs> Over here is where I get ready in the morning. Look, Look at the at skylight. Shaving cream, toothbrush, toothpaste. Hey, this is where I wash my face. Woo, it's been a long, hard day. I use this little towel here to dry myself off. Oh, man. So tough making these episodes. This in here is my closet. Hold on. Look at all the room that I have. Ooh. Look at all this space. You guys want to see my clothes? Look at them all. I've got my adventure pants, my wigwam socks, my undershirts, and of course, a backup shirt just in case an animal poops on me. So what's crazy about the shower? What's crazy about the shower is that, first of all, there's no shower curtain. And you that. just get in and you shower and you have to worry about Somebody looking in the window, like this creeper over here. Gosh, Mario! Mario! Hi. Have you guys ever met Lil Coyote? Woo, woo, woo! Actually, Lil Coyote was made for me by this amazing member of the Coyote Pack, also the same person that made Mini Mario, and Lil Coyote comes on every single adventure. Oh, check this out. Whoa. Big screen TV! Look at that, that's a 27 inch Sony! You guys think you've seen a big TV before? You've never seen a TV that big, and that's a clock. All right, let's go out the back patio. You can walk right out into the desert. Wow! And then you've got another patio. If you guys didn't think you had enough patio space, you haven't seen anything until you've seen this patio space. You can sit here at night and look out on the entire city of Tucson. Check this out. Uh, you know what, before you reveal it, we should get the stuff to make the fire. In case you guys didn't know how to start a fire, I'm gonna show you how. Everybody careful. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. That is absolutely epic. What about my room? We didn't look at your room? No. Let's go look at Mark's room. <laughs> how do we miss Mark's room? Hey, you guys wanna see something else cool? Ooh. Check this out. That's a clean room. Look at this. Look at this, guys. Keep wow. mine. Keep it tight. Keep it tight. I make my bed. What's so, the rule about this section? Uh, Coyote doesn't touch this section. I don't touch any of the gear other than the GoPros and my computer. Because yep. I break things. That's right. I've already broken three cameras this year. Okay, so yeah, this is pretty much the crib. And if you guys really like this episode, then let us know in the comment section below because maybe there'll be more on location. Coyote's Crib Editions coming soon. Crazy! Wait, wait, wait. wait. What? What's missing from this video? Oh, an animal. That's right. Uh, okay, earlier today, we did see a creature in the backyard. Maybe we'll flip this into like an animal adventure now and yeah, let's see get if we can a serious find it. mode. Okay. So this one's kind of crazy, but you're right. We may be able to find this animal. Now, earlier today, I did see it out here in the backyard, and if we're lucky, we might come across it again. Come on, let's go start looking. He was out here earlier. What are we looking for? My little friend Gilbert. What does he look there like? There he is. He's right there. No I way. Can't Do you see him? him? Oh, 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 he's going Whoa. this way. It's a little baby Gila monster. Oh, stay, buddy, stay, buddy. There he is. There he is. There he is. Hi. I can't believe he's still here. There's Gilbert. Oh, he's gonna go down by the tree. That oh, is a my little goodness. juvenile Gila monster. We saw him earlier today. We've seen him multiple times today, crawling around out here in the backyard. Oh, is that his little burrow? Yeah, it might be. He's been walking around out here all day. We have never seen a Gila monster 
just hang out like this. So this must be his territory right here in our backyard. You know, believe it or not, that is a completely wild juvenile heel monster. And actually, this is the time of year that the juveniles are very active. This is probably one that was born last year around this time or in the late summer. And uh, sure enough, right here on location, and just like every on location episode, we managed to somehow feature an animal. I can't believe we found him again. I've come out here several times today, to be honest with you guys, looking just to see if he's still in the area. This is the fifth or sixth time I've seen him right in this little spot right behind our house. How cool is that? That's amazing. Now, what's the rule about helis? You, you don't touch those. No, uh, I have done it in the past with permits to get them up close for the cameras. After I was bitten a couple years ago, just filming one in the wild with GoPro, I no longer try to handle these animals. If you see one in the wild, admire it from a safe distance, just like we're doing right here. Is he getting cool shots, Mario? Yeah. Well, this was pretty cool. We were doing an on location in the house episode, come out here in sandals, but at least we found Gilbert, the backyard healer monster. I'm Coyote Peterson. Be brave, stay wild. We'll see you on the next location. Whoa, I'm hungry. Finding a Gila monster in your backyard is pretty amazing, but getting bitten by one is not. Make sure to go back and watch the episode where I accidentally get chomped by this venomous lizard. And don't forget, subscribe so you can join me and the crew on our next location. Yep, yeah, he got the whole top of my thumb. He got right past the GoPro and he got the whole top of my thumb.